do you feel celebrated enough for the achievement that you've done and um mm. not more than that how do you how do you make it a professional career because yeah. i know that at one point you're working in the family business yes and you said no i need to i need to follow my passion i need to pursue my passion so yeah like those two things i just kind of wanted to okay so as a career in lebanon it's not something that you uh, you could live off of um again i was fortunate enough to have like really supportive parents who from a young age really you know helped me uh uh they, they pushed me to like yes you should follow your goals do whatever you want and stuff like that so me working with the family business was actually something positive for me because you know i travel a lot as an athlete and um by the way so the federation pays for all of our travels so it's not like out of pocket or stuff like that so if i have a world championship a arab championship west asian whatever and stuff like that the national team uh expenses are all covered by the federation um and like gym stuff like if i, I go to the gym i go to a track those are covered by the clubs mm -hmm. so i've never paid the gym membership ever no it's so nice. i feel like this that's is pretty cool hook us yeah. up now. We're, getting, we're getting kind of fucked it's gonna be really weird once i stop like doing this professionally but yeah so i've never paid the gym membership so i have like sponsorships as a duck from from different places like my club right now Antony, and uh, covers all of that stuff and stuff like that but can you make money out of it as like a, a way to live no um so again if my f parents or my family wasn't supportive maybe i wouldn't be able to do this mm. you know as a career is a bad duck. but i chose to actually not worry about making money and uh pursuing you know riches glory or whatever yeah. <laughs> to actually like be a better version of myself mm. you realize in life like life is so short for you not to be doing something that you love for you to actually be working a nine to five job and just to like you know let's accumulate wealth and try to buy this and do that and stuff like that like that's just not me i'm not saying that's wrong of course people some people love that but everybody has to follow a certain passion they have in life and i feel like if i'm able to show people like you can do this in a certain way and hopefully it's going to be easier for the next generation to actually do that like why not i am so happy and i feel like the 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 whole lockdown thing made me really realize and know if the world ended today would i be happy well, and i'm like done. oh my gosh like yes mm. you know i'm doing something i'm really passionate about while at the same time being able to represent my country and putting lebanon out there on a pedestal and you asked if i if i feel like i'm celebrated enough even though it would be nice to be celebrated it's not like my ultimate goal yeah. <laughs>